Power comes from a four-stroke thumper that runs a 66 mm bore and 73 mm stroke with a 9 to 1 compression ratio. Yeah, one longer engines have a, much deserved, reputation for being able to shake the fillings out of your teeth, so Kai added a balancer to take some of the sting out of it and give your hands and butt a break. A single overhead cam times the two valve head for a compact arrangement that keeps the size of the top end to a minimum and the internals as simple as the rest of the rig. You can expect to get 17.75 ponies out of it at 7,500 revolutions per minute with 13 pounds of torque that come on fully at 5,500 revolutions per minute, which is about right for this displacement and unlikely to get away from you, regardless of your level of experience. It doesn't look like the W250 is on any American showroom floors just yet, but it looks like we can expect to pay something in the $5,400 range if it does get here. Right now, I'm seeing it in either black or a nice midnight blue in some of the Asian markets.